We start recording. From my downline, there's been 35 affiliates added this month so far. Um, and like, they're still adding people and like after our win network, and I'll get into that after we start talking, but I got them all set up with what I shared in Master Affiliate on closing in your pre-enrollees, sealing the deal. And um, so now, like, even though Wednesday's family night, a lot of them are like, what can I do? So, um, you know, they've got those pre-enrollees from the week that they're all following up with now and cool. talking to. So... Um, I like the layout that they gave us because it kind of just like gives you absolute purpose of every day, every you know day. what I'm saying? Yep. And I love that. And so like every day I share in my team chat, okay, it's <laughs> Tuesday. This is what today is about. Um, and I'm already starting to talk to people, um, cause like some people won't go live. And I'm not going to, I mean, I'm going to try to push them out of their comfort zone, but some people won't. So I don't want them to feel like a failure. Um, so I'm helping them find a product um, that they can spotlight for that day. You know, whether it's the oil, some people are all about the pet products. Some people are about the relief cream. Some people are just about sprays. So um, I'm about all of them. <laughs> Absolutely. So um, just to help them be prepared before that day comes and so it's just been you know like I said every day is is been um just trying to keep people on track right but the important thing is once you start building a team is finding that balance um you know like for me so that I'm still recruiting even though I'm spending a majority of my day in like management mode I don't want to lose that recruiting mindset Right. Because that is so important because if you go solely into management mode, um, what if somebody drops off your team? I know. Mm -hmm. What if you have a 5k affiliate and all of a sudden they pick up and they're gone? You know what I'm saying? So I just constantly am in recruit mode at all times. I stay in recruit mode no matter what. Um, and the thing that I find is find a way that is going to make it be as organized and as simple for you as possible. I don't like a bunch of complications. I want to be able to point and direct my affiliates to, to exactly what they need to do to be successful. So um, that's the big thing. So I will, do you want me to just start out with what I'm doing with the yeah. affiliates right now? Yeah, I think okay. that's, I think we, we've got uh, nine people on. Okay. Uh, Marissa, did you come on with, uh, um, let me say hi to Marissa. Did, you, did she come on with uh, a video, Marissa? Oh, Marissa's, um, that's my daughter. Oh, okay. <laughs> hi, Marissa. <She's laughs> okay. She may just not want to. Yeah. <laughs> well, she's got little kids, so I can understand. <laughs> okay so um i'm gonna do just like i just signed a new affiliate and what steps i have them do because okay. even though i'm doing this with my everyday affiliates um the new ones are like they're just like taking this and running with it and that's what's so important is to get people excited and off the ground and running day one so when um somebody signs up I immediately get them plugged in. We, I am in a team page with, with my upline and I immediately get them plugged into win network right away. Those are the two that I start out with right away. So like people that are just under Laura are going to start out with Laura's team and win network right away. I don't overwhelm them, adding them to a ton of stuff right off the bat, because like I said, I want to get them going. I want them comfortable and running with it. So yeah. what I do when, they sign up. I oh, I lost. Sorry, I was trying to move somebody's thing away, and I like took Zoom off. Um, so what I do is I get them plugged in right, you know, right off the bat. I explain, um, you know, what it is. I'm gonna send you these. Accept this. Let me know when you accept, and we're good. So I have a question. Um, mm -hmm. When you say you plug them into a group, if you're plugging them into Laura's group, are you plugging them into the group of? Um, yeah. Uh, Master Affiliate Group? Yes. And, and Win Network Group? 
Yes. Okay, because I, I get to where it's like we've got groups and then we've got chats. Yeah. Oh, okay. yes. No, it's I'm talking chats. like like your team leader group. So okay. whoever your upline is, most uplines have a group. So if you, like I said, if you're under Laura, then you're going to want to plug them into master affiliates. And I don't know how um, Laura completely runs her team. Um, like I said, everybody has their own means of um, leadership and, and how they do things. So, um, so then you would just follow, because like with me, the first thing I do in my team is I plug them into our unit one and that is the welcome. That's the rules. That is, um, I do a little video. I used in my other phone. I did a video. Okay. This is how you get into your back office, blah, 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 you know, so that they could get into that. Okay. But anyway, so then when I'm talking to them, I ask them right away, how much time in a day are you um, putting into this business? How much time do you have? There's people that work full time. There's people that are home all the time. So you don't want to expect something out of them during a certain time that they can't, they can't be there, okay? So I find out immediately what their schedule is. And that way I know the best way to help them. So they tell me that what you wanna do is, what is your why? What is your goal in this business? You know, are they wanting a couple hundred extra dollars? Are they wanting to go all in and rank super affiliate? Um, are they just wanting enough to pay for their oil? So that you can fine tune this business to meet the goals that they want and not expect something out of them that they don't want. This isn't about us, this is about what they want out of this business. So them knowing and hearing that goal is so important. So write that goal down, know what exactly you're going for. Right. And there's your and desire from our book club. Right. right. In the meantime, I am writing that down in my planner next to their name because that way um, I know. And like I have my list of all my affiliates in one spot. So like when I'm going through, say, Team Win, if I'm going through my team, I've got all my affiliates in one spot and I can go through and write down and tag them. So but by that, I know what my affiliates are doing. So that's important. So step one is getting that goal, knowing what they're going for. Step two, I ask them, do you know at least five people that could use this oil or could use making some extra money? And they're like, absolutely. I'm like, how many people do you know? And they're like, I don't know that many people. I don't hardly talk to people. How many people do you have on Facebook? And they're like, 300. I'm like, okay, you got 300 people you can talk to. They're already your friends. That's already your warm market. You know, this is time to like step outside that comfort zone. Um, and I'm just going to say something. I'm not going to go into detail. Um, after a conversation I had today, not everybody, um, like I said, does things the same way. Okay. Some people have different ideas of how you should be marketing out there, how you should be getting people how, what you should be starting them with. This is just what I'm doing. So it's kind of, you know, everybody can kind of do it. You can tweak it to your own or however you want to do. So with that, I have them start making a list. Even though Facebook is full of people, I'm like, start writing down everybody you know, because I want them to start making that list. Okay, and say they come up, they're like, well, right now I can think of 20 people. Okay, this, that's a great start. And I have them message people right away. And what I'm having them message people is, hey, um, Michelle, how are you today? I am so excited because I just joined, I just locked arms in the number one cannabis business. I just started this opportunity and I'm absolutely loving sharing it with everyone I know. And so, you know, something along that lines. Um, basically what I'm saying is so happy to announce. Um, oh, no, I'm on the wrong one. Hold on, I'm trying to read my screen. I have everything. You gave us out. that. I, I can cut and paste that into the notes. You gave us okay, that. Okay, that later then. Okay, yep. so, so I have them send out this message, okay? And what it's doing is telling people about this free opportunity, it's telling people about the sample pack, and it's telling people what they're doing, all right? These people are coming back with like, I had one lady seriously 
message me and put me in a chat. And she had five people at one time that were rolling in once just from her sending out that message. Wow. All right. Now, a lot of people aren't in agreement with this free enrollment because they're like, they're signing up for free. They're not ordering product. You're not making money right away. But here's my thoughts. Me too. Here's my thoughts. Um, I am way yellow. I'm not red. I'm way yellow. Here's my mental thought, okay? We are here to help people. Not everybody has the financial means right now of ordering product, of ordering an executive pack, of ordering even a builder pack. But when you're talking to that person, when you are talking to somebody about this business and they ask you, what do I need to put into it? You know, I let them know about those packages. I let them know what's out there. And if they say, you know, I don't have the money right now, that's when I'm like, you know what? That's okay. Because you can join this absolutely free right now. We'll get you rocking and rolling in this business so that you can make that money. So you can make that money to help your family. And it's 60 days from um, yeah. April 30th. Yeah. Yes, it's 60 okay. days. But I'm going to tell you a secret. A lot of people, there's a lot of leaders that will be out there and they're like, you've got to order a builder pad. You've got to order a full-size bottle or a full spray or you're going to go inactive. That is not true. Not true, if you no. have somebody that's in dire straits, that is absolutely broke, but wants to keep their business going, a sample pack or one of those little oils that we just came out with, it's only 10 bucks, yep. that is going to keep them active. As long as they have something that will keep them active. So um, I'm there to help my people. I'm there to help them be successful, but I'm also there to help them if they don't have the money to go buy a pack right off the bat, okay? So I get them messaging people day one. Here's the thing, as a leader, you've got to be ready when they have those questions. Um, if you work a job, reach out to your, see if you have somebody, if you have an accountability partner, if you have an upline that can help you out. Um, I've helped people that, you know, weren't even on my team. I've helped a lot of my sidelines out. And so, you know, there's times we're all there for each other for three ways, but you don't want people waiting for 10 hours to get an answer right. um, because that's, that's kind of rough when they're new. So with somebody new, just make sure they have somewhere to go, whether it's Laura's group um, or whatever team lead group you have, there's always like a question and answer spot that they can ask questions in. So <clears throat> that's the next thing. So after they're messaging people and they're like, they want to take my tour, I'm like, Awesome. And what I do, even though I'm teaching them where their links are, I look in my Unilevel and I see what their username is. I give them all their links. I give them their sample link, their full product link, and a two, one tour link right away because they're messaging people before they start their training. Okay. So I give them their links right away. And if you go under Unilevel and you change it to the current month and Unilevel is under group volume, Right. If you go there and change it to the current month and you scroll all the way down at the bottom, it's going to show your most recent affiliates that signed up and it will say their full name backslash right. their username. Their username. Yep. yep. So you can provide them with that so that because they're, met, they're starting this business right away before even training. If they say, well, I don't understand the compensation plan, you don't have to. No. Let's get you rocking and rolling. Let's get you making some money and we're going to learn this as we go along together. Um, you know, if they have specific questions, obviously I'm going to answer them, but you know what I'm saying? It's like, just let's get that excitement and get going. So from there, they're messaging people and I tell them right away, you know, once they get that pre-enrolled in and I tell them to wait at least an hour because it takes about a half hour, they're going to get the email when they start that pre-enroll. That email is going to come right away when they start taking that tour. So I tell them, you know, and what they're saying when they're giving that tour out after they give the tour out is they're saying, okay, here's, here's the link. Let's chat as soon as you're done. I'd love to hear what you think. So when they come back and they say um, they finished it or they reach out to them an hour later, what, Hey, just wanted to check in. What did you love best about that tour? So it's just kind of giving them a question to kind of start feeling them out. <clears throat> With that, they start the conversation. I have an amazing upline that is ready to talk to us right now. They can answer any questions you have and just give you a little more on this opportunity. 
all right, can you get on a call real quick? They get me on a three-way call or a three-way chat. And I answer any questions um, because a lot of what people are saying is I'm not a salesperson, thank God. You know, I don't know many people, you're gonna, you know. So I'm kind of giving them those answers because what I'm teaching my team in the process is I'm teaching them to network and build relationships. Um, what I'm doing, my way of growing my business isn't, no, am I going to 50K in, in 30 days? No, I'm not. But I'm building long lasting relationships with my affiliates. I'm building that trust and I'm helping them be, you know, whatever steps. If they want to make leaps, I'm going to be there. If they want to take baby steps, I'm going to be there. So it's just kind of fine tuning and knowing what your affiliates need. So send that message, get them sending that message right away. And then they are like literally just coming to me saying, hey, they're interested in the business. You know, and if somebody says, I don't have experience, you don't need experience. All you're doing is what you're doing on Facebook every day. You're sharing ads for JCPenney. You're talking to your friends. If somebody has a question, you answer them with value or love. And that's exactly what you're doing with this business. You're sharing things on your page of value that is there to help people. You're talking to people, you're explaining the business, you're still being their friend, you're explaining the products, and in return, you're giving the value, you're giving a solution to their problem, and you're creating customers and affiliates. Um, so with this plan that um, the Win Network gave us, which was absolutely amazing, it's like, no matter how long you've been in this business, you learn something new every day. I know. I mean, it's just crazy. So um, I even highlighted the actual days as I took my notes. So like Friday is obviously our first day of the week. All right. So that's when um, they're telling us to go on social media and all that. So we're in Wednesday right now. My team has been working at that follow up all day. Um, what I'm having them do, and I put the outline in Laura's page, is you're going and getting all the people that took your pre-enroll, that took your tour, you're going into your, um, your binary tree, and you go to the bottom and you search that, that pre-enrolled person's name, okay? You change it to name, you search their name, and what it's gonna do, when you search the person's name that took that tour, it's gonna bring a box up with them at the top, and it's gonna show everybody that has either taken the tour, signed up as an affiliate, or signed up uh, as a customer under them, because the system hasn't flushed yet, so everybody is under them. So what I'm doing is I'm taking a screenshot of that. I'm sending that to them, saying, oh my gosh, look at all these people under you right now. This whole system is gonna flush on Thursday. I'm so excited to help you lock in your spot today so that all of them are gonna be under you. Because otherwise what's gonna happen, they don't lock in their spot, that first person that did is gonna to flush to the top and everybody's gonna go under. So I'm creating that excitement. I'm showing them how many is built under that strong leg under them already. And just saying, are you ready to do this? Let's rock and roll, girl. You know, and I mean, that's how I talk to my people. Because if I talk to like, yeah, if I talk I to like Michelle, it would be different. I you know, I would talk to your people. The way you, and I've even been yelled at once for calling somebody hunt. But can I, can I ask a question? Mm -hmm. If somebody signs up on Wednesday, are they going to flush on Thursday, or are they going to no. go next week? You know, I have not had people flush, and it's kind of weird because, like, you know what? Yes, they will. Yeah, because it, it yeah they will it flushes every Thursday. Thursday I'm sorry. Night. They'll still be in your contact manager, but they still flush. Wait, okay. wait, wait, wait! If somebody signs up on Wednesday, as right, a pre enrollee, as a pre enrollee, but they don't, if they um, but they don't upgrade, then they go to the bottom. Yes. So anyone mm, after flush. them moves above them. Yeah. So they flush down. Yeah. And everybody that locked so in flush makes out. it sound like it goes out of the way. They don't. They just drop down. Oh, yeah. They don't flush. Flush to me Not sounds flush. like they flush out of the system, but they don't. They just <laughs> yeah, lose their position. Now. They go to the bottom. It's like shoots and ladders. They right. they hit shoot. <laughs> 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 I 
Yeah, that <laughs> sounds bad too down the chute. Yeah. <laughs> well, I had, so I had two people today that um, took the tour. So if they took the tour today, I need to get with them tomorrow. Yeah, because it flushes at midnight. Because it's going to flush at midnight. Okay. Okay. Well, that's the, the way they, right. The way they send it to us in the emails is the cutoff. The cutoff yeah. is at midnight Thursday. Right. Midnight. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so if, if they don't they, upgrade, they are going to lose everybody that's underneath them. Yeah, right. they're going to. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And then somebody who's above them that doesn't do anything will fall below them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So wouldn't they? Wouldn't you? If they took the tour today, wouldn't you want to talk to them today instead yeah. of tomorrow? Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. And that's why, if you look at the layout that Win Network did. Um, they have you on Friday posting about people taking your tour. They have you really pushing on Friday because that's like day one, you know, and like I'll t have people take the tour every day of the week, but Friday is the day you really need to be pushing that because that gives them all the way until Thursday to get those emails because that's what's so amazing about our system is it's doing 90% of that marketing for you. Because when they take that tour and then Michelle comes in and takes my tour, it's going to say, hey, Laura, congratulations. Michelle just took the tour under you. Or, hey, congratulations, Laura. Michelle just placed it, locked in her spot on this team. It's giving them and it's telling them, lock your spot in now. Right. You know, so it's giving them that incentive um, to really lock it in before um, somebody else does. It's like giving that urgency um, for them to want to do it. Right. And then the so way that Chris, fun. yeah, and the way Chris um, mentioned and, and Jermaine that with our Zoom on uh, Thursday night, they'll help close it. I mean, yeah. we didn't ask for two better people to, to have all of our pre enrollees get on the, the Zoom Thursday night with <laughs> and have them talk to them about how they are going to close the deal for us. I mean, it, it's, it's, it definitely is the will to win because. Yeah. <laughs> and here's the thing too for me um with my team so friday now we're really pushing um getting on your social media and pushing that tour and to get people to check out your business opportunity but as well friday is your best day for follow-up on sealing your deal on product orders because right. people get paid on fridays People are, a lot of people have Fridays off, you know, whatever the case may be. So I always work with that follow-up list on products as well on Fridays. That's like my day. I like do it in my team chat. Um, it's always follow-up Friday. And they're just merely going out. They're going down their list. Hey, Michelle, hope you're having an amazing Friday. I just wanted to check in and see if you're able to hop on that link okay. And if you had any questions, I already know Michelle didn't take that link, hop on that link, okay, because I didn't get the email that she took my tour, right. or I didn't get the email that she ordered that sample pack. So I'm just kindly checking in on them, making sure they got on that link, okay, and if they had any questions. <clears throat> and it's a good way. I always end it with a question, you know, for them to come back. And nine times out of ten, they're like, oh, my God, I forgot. You know, I'm so sorry. I'm like, don't be sorry. But also, people may have questions. Yeah. And one minute, um, Laura. Okay. It's telling me that we only have eight minutes left, and we have to upgrade. What does that mean? Oh, it's because you're basic. So, oh, shoot, basic. We have I know. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm licensed, and you're basic. <laughs> well, yeah, you only get thirty minutes. Thirty yeah. minutes. Uh, so, oh, shoot. Okay. There's a note that says upgrade. Can I upgrade? It, that, if you do that, you have to pay. You have to pay. Oh, okay. Because I pay for it. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to pay for it once once it stops being free. So talk talk fast. It's, talk it's, fast. It's, <laughs> so there's one thing I want to tell you guys real quick. Always, always, always check your contact manager all the time. Here's why. You won't get an email for this, but they appear. And it says, um, it'll show a name. It'll say preferred customer pending backslash no order. Yeah. So what that is, is somebody has clicked to take you, clicked on your sample pack link and they never completed the order. So mm -hmm. everyone that appears with that, I message them, hey, 
I saw you hopped on that sample pack link and the order didn't go through. I just wanted to make sure you didn't have any questions or need any help getting that order in today. Okay. So um, that's something to check out. And have you had people respond to you on that? Because I have a ton of those and I didn't yeah. know where they came from and I don't send out my sample link. I get it. Is your sample link in your page anywhere? I don't know, but a lot of them have extensions, like a phone yeah. number with an extension. Yep, I get, I get that too. And a lot of them don't answer me, but I get a few that say, you know, I kept trying and I couldn't get it to work, you know, but a lot of them don't. Yeah, I get a bunch of them with extensions and like yeah. names this long. <laughs> yeah, and the names doubled. Yeah. yeah. Now, Tammy, I thought customers can't order sample packs. If they're not a customer yet. Only when they're a customer. The, uh, oh. You can only, only order. Affili only affiliates can, can order sample packs. Huh? Only affiliates can because it's in your back. It's in your, your back. Um, <laughs> no, you have your sample pack link to share. Yeah. Yeah, on the link. You have a link. Yeah. Well, that, right, but they can't. If they don't have a sample pack link, they just can't go in and get. Um, right. You have right. to send your sample pack link. Right? Oh, okay. So you send your sample pack link to somebody and then yeah. they order. Got you. Okay. Thank and you. See, I, share my, I share my link on buy, sell, trade groups a lot too. Like I will do a post and after it's been up and I've answered all the messages, like a day or two later, I'll go in and drop my tour link or I'll drop my sample link. Okay. And so sometimes you get people out of those groups that will just click on it and either don't want it or don't finish or whatever so what do you what do you put in the, in the buy sell what do you what are you advertising in the buy sell link um when i in the buy sell group i have 50 uh amazing thc free sample packs ready to ship to your mailbox today 11.95 save me for more info ah, okay buy sell trade um, what group buy sell trade groups like um online yard sale type groups Oh, some of so, them don't allow you. Some of them don't allow you, but there's a lot that do. There's a lot of um, groups out there that do, um, like local. I, I always tell my affiliates to like try local ones. Right. Um, like I grew up in Grand Haven, so I hit those in Grand Haven, and a lot of them they let people do that. Um, another thing, um, work from home position. Uh, work from home position available, no startup costs, paid every Thursday, work from your phone, save me for more info. Right. Just show, and I do it with a colored background, emojis, whatever, but I always say, you know, save me for more info or save more info, and that way everyone who comments, I absolutely write their name down, and here's something I, I always friend request them. Because even if they don't accept it, if that page gets, um, and I screenshot it, but if that page shuts down my post, I have all, I can go and view all my sent friend requests. Oh, good. Okay. Yeah. How do you view your sent friend requests? You have to do it from a computer. Um, if you go to, you know where the little friend re emoji is at the top? Like uh -huh. where your friend Click there. Mm-hmm. Click find friends. Uh huh. And then click view sent request. Oh, okay. Is it live? Yeah, hold on. And it's really good. Like, if you have a ton of friend requests you've sent out and they haven't accepted in a long time, get rid of those because it pulls you down in the Facebook algorithm. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I know I have some. You know, yeah, when I first when I first learned that, oh my god, <laughs> it took me forever to go through and um and, so and cancel know. the request. But yeah, that definitely helps with the Facebook algorithm and delete anybody who's inactive. Um, if they have like a deleted or inactive account, um, because that will bog you down in the algorithm as well. Okay. Okay. Good. Uh, and the biggest thing, guys. Comment, comment, comment. Like, go every day on your new friends, your recently added friends. Comment, comment, because you're bringing yourself up even by private messaging people, even like birthday wishes and that type of thing that you know we do in these pushes. Yeah. Um, any type of engagement you have is bringing you up. It's bringing you up in the news feed, and I just make sure that I go out every day. I do birthday wishes. I'm always 
commenting on my potentials any of my potentials i'll like go through like say people haven't answered my messages in forever i'll spend a whole day going through and commenting on my potentials posts because what that's doing it's now bringing me up in their feed right right and eric uh john mosley said and that's what we're starting to do on our our half hour push is to comment on the stories because yeah. that brings it to uh, your private message and that tells yep. po uh, Facebook that you are a value and that'll bring you right back up to the top again too. So yep. I, go through, uh, I go through and, and we'll comment on stories and you see things, you know, from people you haven't seen in forever, but right. they're on stories. So yep. stories is huge. Yep. Um, so like, you know, I know like with my team, I'm like three posts a day, max, three posts okay. a day, max. You know, one about, you know, positivity, something funny, something, one about your family lifestyle and one product, your business, okay? Um, but you can blow stories up with stuff about your products. You can highlight a different product constantly yeah. in your stories and people, you know, it's not going to affect you and make you seem spammy because it's, you know, it's up in the stories and it's actually bringing you, you can see exactly how many people have viewed it. And then, then what I do is I go back and I see how many viewed, like there's 47 of them. I take a screenshot of each of their names and then I yep. go back and thank them for viewing my uh, yep. story and did they have any questions and wasn't it funny or, you know, and then I get that engagement right all, all over again. Yeah. Yeah. And you would be, it's funny how many people will comment on your stories that will never comment on your posts. I know. Isn't that weird? Mm -hmm. Yeah. My, um. Laura, was there anything else I'm trying to think? Um, I don't, I don't know. I took uh, notes. I took notes. Okay. Awesome. And, and we have less than a minute. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. Well, that was perfect timing then. Perfect timing. <laughs> yeah. That's but awesome. I'll, I'll go back and listen to it and just make sure I have everything we said in, in our notes and then I'll, I'll post those and, um, I'll post them on the, uh, the new, um, mastermind group. <laughs> Awesome. But I think, I think we love the blue. The blue is good. The blue yes. is for the, my daily FTC choice. Blue. Yep. And yeah. if anyone has questions, feel free to private message me. Um, I have no issues. 